blacksmithing is the process of turning wrought iron into the final product. By heating the iron, it can be shaped using a hammer, chisel, and anvil. Blacksmithing is possible because iron has a fairly unique property in that it doesn't immediately change from liquid to solid at high temperatures, and instead becomes soft and malleable from 800 to 2800 degrees Fahrenheit. To learn the trade of metalworking, I turned to local blacksmith Dave to teach me the basics. Using a propane forge, he heated the iron until it was red hot. The first step was taking the iron bloom and compressing it into a solid piece. So where I'm putting that in the fire is right where the burner is coming down so it's in the hottest spot. I'm already starting to work with the grain of the metal. One of the, one of the key critical things uh, to know that you've got a good weld is to, is to turn it on the diamond. As we keep working with it, Smithing. Now it's my turn. After numerous trips back and forth between the forge and the anvil, I was finally starting to get a workable solid piece of iron. Go, sir. After showing me basic blacksmithing, Dave showed me the process of shaping and punching a chunk of iron to make a hammerhead. Okay. If making a simple hammer is this hard, I can only imagine what it'll be like in the wilderness with nothing but sticks and stones. As long as I do both measurements the same, we should come out okay. First of all, I'm gonna need to get it hot, but not real hot, and put those marks in there really well, because when that comes out there bright red hot, you can't even see it. They disappear. And have to let it cool down a little bit and then take your punch and, and start you start the hole with the end of the punch. That way before you really start driving it home you know that when you come out put that thing on the anvil put the punch up there that it's in 